Hello students of class 9. Uh, the other day we had seen that the narrator had won the road engine and uh, it was the start of all his troubles. And uh, we have seen that uh, uh, somehow you know the fair owner agreed to uh, keep the engine till the end of the season and uh, but for that he had to pay a rent and he had to pay a rent of as much as um, uh, 10 rupees per month and he had to pay that for three months in a row and uh, which was uh, much more than uh, the rent he paid for his own house uh, which was just uh, four rupees. Uh, he had uh, tried to, um, you know, uh, first ask the owner of the uh, fair owner to uh, take the, you know, the, to arrange um, for somebody who could uh, drive the engine to his uh, house, and uh, he also. Um, Try to approach the uh, mail engine driver, but um, you know nobody was uh, willing to uh, you know help him in that way. So he decided to sell off the engine, and uh, he approached everybody whom he met. But uh, then he decided that he would uh, talk to the uh, secretary of the local cosmopolitan club, who had a golf uh, course. Um, uh, uh, who could need, uh, uh, could possibly make a good use of it, but then uh, he also did not uh, want to buy it. Uh, and then he went to the municipal chairman and he started, you know, giving a lecture. Um, and uh, the person was uh, quite, you know, uh, disappointed. And you know, so ultimately the. Uh, narrator could not uh, sell the uh, engine so um, he was already in trouble but more trouble came for him when um, there uh, you know a cattle fair was going to be held at the same gymkhana grounds uh, and uh, because of that uh, cattle fair uh, the municipality sent him a notice uh, that uh, the engine had to be taken off from that ground within 24 hours. That is, he got a very um, small window to take that uh, engine out of that uh, ground. Uh, so he was, uh, as he kept on saying that he was a poor man and uh, from the start, Means from the day he got that engine, he had tried to, you know, sell it off uh, or ask anybody to drive it uh, to his house, but to no avail. So um, after a lot of searching, uh, what he uh, managed to get was the uh, he met with a temple priest, and that temple priest uh, actually came to his help. This temple priest had a uh, had an elephant. Okay, so um, the temple priest agreed that uh, he would, uh, you know, give the um, serve means uh, he would uh, allow the narrator to take the um, elephant. Uh, or to give uh, the, the elephant would give the services uh, to the uh, narrator to help him take out the engine out of the ground. But it was, you can imagine that it was a road roller or road engine. It, it's a huge thing. Though temple, I mean, though an elephant is a huge animal, but it was not enough for uh, only um, a temple elephant to take that um, out. So he uh, also took the help of 50 coolies and um, another person was Joseph and who was Joseph? Joseph was a dismissed bus driver. Now uh, it's very important to understand that he was dismissed means he was thrown out of his job. A dismissed bus driver. So 
since uh, he was a uh, um, so joseph had assured the narrator okay if the engine is kept in motion and then uh, you know he could steer uh, uh, you know he could uh, be at the steering wheel so on the uh, appointed date uh, joseph was sitting on the driver seat and the telephone uh, sorry and the elephant was yoked to the engine and 50 coolies uh, uh, had to push the engine from behind uh, everything went fine till the um, you know as long as the engine was there uh, inside the gymkhana grounds but as soon as it went off the road uh, it began to move in a zigzag manner why because the elephant pulled in one direction joseph steered the wheel in other direction and the 50 coolies uh, they were pushing but you know they they just clung to that engine okay they just uh, you know held on to that engine and they tried to push it without knowing you know where they were actually uh, sending the engine to so what happened was that uh, it went and hit a compound wall and the moment it hit the compound wall it broke so there was an uh, absolute confusion uh, people cried out very loudly and when they uh, cried out loudly the um, elephant uh, got in a panic and uh, the elephant started you know trumpeting loudly and uh, because of all this uh, confusion and not only did it uh, start uh, trumpeting loudly but it also you know um, tried to break itself free and that's why you know it snapped at its means it tried to snap its rope and um, so you know it started kicking and when it kicked you know the elephant broke again a further length of the wall and it was reduced to powder so you can understand that what a confusion was created because of this road engine and uh, the there was you know uh, people also started uh, shouting all the more and um, uh, the elephant also got hurt um, uh due to this and finally what happened the owner of the compound wall came gave a slap and the police came and the narrator was arrested so we stop here today we will do the rest of the chapter in the next class thank you